Are you thinking about hiring a personal assistant without the overhead of a full-time employee? Fixer AI claims to be the next level virtual assistant that can handle your tasks 24-7. But the question is, is it really worth their money? Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. Before you click that buy button or sign up for a plan, stick around because in today's video we are going to break down everything you need to know about Fixer AI its key features, potential drawbacks, and the must-ask questions before you invest. So let's dive in and see if Fixer AI is truly the productivity boosts it promises, or if you just explore other options first. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do, visit the official website of Fixer.ai. On the top corner, you have the option to log in using your credentials. But we all know that the best option is to click the start your free trial. If you do, you'll be forwarded to a new page. It's very simple. You just have to provide all the information needed. And of course, to make the account creation faster and easier, you can sign up either using your Google or your Microsoft account. Now, in our case, we are going to use our Gmail account. Now, from here, you just have to follow the on-screen instructions. So, after sign up, you need to create an organization, connect your email, and of course, invite your teammates, especially if you're working in a collaborative environment. I'm going to click that, and you will be forwarded to connect your Gmail account. So, you have all of these options. Connect with your Google Workspace or Gmail, and of course, Microsoft 365, connecting your Outlook, depending on your preferences. Again, in our case, we're going to be using Gmail, now at this point, it's very important to give full access to Fixer AI so that it can access your Google account, especially your Gmail, all right? What will happen is it will be forwarded to a new page. It's very simple and you want to make sure that you are connected to an active and internet connection because that could interfere with the loading times. I'm going to skip that for now, but if you wanted to connect your Zoom account with a Fixer.ai, you can do so. So you can have like... um plug in note taker okay i'm gonna skip that for now and right after the bat you will be offered for a premium free trial okay 14 days free no commitment but if you're not comfortable with that i'm gonna keep, uh, skip the offer and you can invite your team which is kind of helpful if you are working in a collaborative environment if you're working with a um maybe um, other freelancers other creatives or maybe with their client you might want to invite them but for now, I am going to remind me later, okay? And we will be forwarded to the main homepage of Fixer.ai. And as you may notice, it's very clean and intuitive. We have been using Fixer.ai for quite some time. And let me tell you, it's very easy to use. Do not be bombarded with the uh, things that you can see here. It's not overwhelming. As a matter of fact, it's very easy to use. All right, so inbox sync completed. So, all right, so you can go to Gmail if you wanted. As you can see, you have like 300 email have been organized into eight distinct categories. You can like AI draft replies have been working for emails requiring a response. Let me uh, go to Gmail right now. And as you may notice, these are going to be the labels that have been organized by Fixer.ai. All right. So there's kind of like um, eight lab labels to respond, FYI, comment, notification, meeting update, awaiting reply, action, and of course, marketing. With that said, of course, it's going to be like um, your assistant to um, organize your email. Okay, it's very helpful because we have been using this for quite some time. Now, I'm going to go back very quickly to our Fixer platform. Now, let me discuss the features and tools here in the left side area of, uh, of the navigation dashboard. So the categorization automatically organizes your incoming emails into intelligent categories remember i've shown you earlier that the uh, fixer.ai automatically categorized the emails in our my in my gmail account all right so the good thing is that the ai kind of like sorts emails so you can quickly prioritize what matters most without manually tagging or filtering all right for example you can choose from to respond, to FYI, comment, notification, awaiting reply, and action. So these are going to be the defaults 
once you have um, connected fixer.ai into your email account it doesn't matter if it's gmail or outlook now obviously here the drafts now here's where fixer.ai comes into help it helps you create draft for replies to your inbox especially if it's cluttered for example you can create a draft prompt right here and then you can provide custom instructions to the ai that generates your draft email replies all right and then after that you need to create the uh gmail or outlook default so in our case that's gonna be like maybe um ariel let's say if we have an ariel here if you don't have let's stick with the um, default and then for the font size maybe like something like a three font color is it's up to you maybe let's say we're gonna use red instead and then that's gonna be for follow-ups when you click the update preferences all right so here let's say let me make sure that's correct let's click the update preferences and then that's it says on the bottom configuration updated now now if i go back very quickly to the categorized label from fixer.ai and i went to the marketing there's going to be an email here from shopify and then at the bottom you see that there's going to be an automatic draft for replies which is how to use fixer.ai so we set this up earlier in the fixer.ai settings so that's one of the smartest way for you to utilize and exhaust the tools that fixer.ai offers all right and then and then there's going to be an option for the meetings you'll see upcoming events that fixer has organized or scheduled for you if you have that it syncs with your email and calendar to pull in relevant meetings offering summaries preparation notes or even scheduling suggestions remember earlier during the account creation it um offers if you want to integrate fixer.ai to your zoom account all right so if you haven't already click the record ad hoc meeting you will be forwarded here all right so that just put in the zoom google meet or microsoft teams link so that fixer.ai will be your um plug in note taker and then the scheduling allows you to book meetings effortlessly fixer can scan your calendar availability propose time slots and send scheduling links it's more of like Calendly if you're working with Calendly if you have tried that so it's built into your assistant workflow it also prevents double booking and handles rescheduling all right so you have these general scheduling default meeting duration minutes and you also have the option if you wanted fixer to include a scheduling link in your calendar drafts but you need to upgrade to the pro plan if you wanted that here okay now speaking of the upgrade to the plan so right now we're using their free trial but of course if you wanted to scale up to the professional plans you might want to up to the uh 37.50 and you have get to have all these perks and benefits just click the upgrade now and you would have that and of course you also have the integrations you can connect your email calendar and of course your crm to hubspot your zoom and a lot more now if you are looking for authentic user reviews detailed feedback pricing information and potential alternatives to fixer.ai you can visit reputable software review platforms such as g2.com and capterra these sites offer valuable insights from real users and can help you make uninformed decision based on your specific needs and budget and with that being said that wraps up our dive into fixer ai so if you're looking for an ai productivity tool that simplifies task management and scales within your business fixer ai offers impressive automation and a user-friendly dashboard however keep in mind the subscription costs and the learning curve for advanced features it's powerful yes but it's not a set it and forget it solution for small teams or solo entrepreneurs weigh the roi carefully now for larger operations seeking robust automation fixer ai might just be the productivity boost 
you've been searching for. If you found this breakdown helpful, do not forget to like, subscribe, and tap that notification bell so you won't miss future reviews of cutting-edge tools just like this one. If you have any questions or experiences with Fixer AI, drop them in the comments below. would love to hear from you. And as always, thank you so much for watching. And remember, the best tech is the one that truly works for you. See you in the next one.